themselves back to 3-2 in this competition with a chance of drawing it tomorrow. As the Fraser starts in for Sidhu will cross the line there, but he's going to get two runs, certainly, probably three. And four. <laughs> Robin Smith uh, juggling with that, dribbling with it. He couldn't keep it inside the rope. Lovely shot by Sidhu. Still he could bat a bit. So can enter it in, and that's four more. That might be four. Yes, it's going to beat Stewart. It's very fine. And this is a very quick scoring ground, so that's another problem that Graham Gooch has to counter. Yes, the bowlers have to be very, very accurate. We'll stick for dot ball on that one, I think. That's over the top. That's very well struck. Nicely timed. Please, Graham Gooch. And that's Char runs over mid on. Four more to the Indian total. Uh, that's going to be runs again. Another chase for Hick. Just gets a hand on it, so two more. And that also brings the 100 up now for India. 100 for two they are in the 20th over. Runs coming freely again. Two more to Sidhu, and that's his 50. It's been a splendid innings, this. Not the sort of obdurate effort we've seen in the test matches. It's been much freer. 65 balls it's taken him. He's hit five good fours. And it's been a fine knock. It's about the fact that Sidhu... Oh, well, that's a splendid stroke. A skimmer. Four runs, just second bounce over the boundary. Oh, that's splendid. He's pulled it away. That's going for four more. Sidhu, no respecter of reputations or anything when the mood's upon him. Oh, it's a magnificent stroke again from Sidhu. It was a half volley, and he found the gap to perfection. Well, he loved it, didn't he? You see the shake of the fist. He really gave this a wallop. That's four more. Just, no, Stewart, who's a, a good sprinter, he couldn't get to that. Oh, delicate, it's four more. This ceaseless tide of runs continues. in the air but it Gooch moved a bit late I don't think he could have got the catch he might just have stopped the ball but it beat him away for four more should all play his way Lewis's throw comes in but the second run was easily there the 150 is up And there we go again. You aren't going to stop that, Alex Stewart. Sidhu on strike. He's clipped that away. Races away for four. So Azaruddin may have departed, but it hasn't necessarily stopped the run flow. Facing Devon Malcolm. And there it is, that's his hundred, he punches the air in delight, off will come the helmet to reveal the patka underneath, and Navjot Sidhu has once again shown that he really likes these English bowlers. Well, it's been a wonderful hundred again, he's had such a good season, Sidhu, and that hundred, these are the figures, it's come up in 105 balls. Gone for four. Dermot Reeves straying down the leg side. The long leg is up. Well, that's pushed into the gap. Devon Malcolm's at long leg. 
and another misfield. Well, this is where the press is telling on England's fielders they must try and do better this time. That's launched straight down the ground. That's going to be four. Neil Fairbrother can't come round in time to cut that off. It's a wonderful shot from Sidhu. And that's going to take some of the pressure out of the Indian dressing room. India have won this fifth Charms Cup One Day International by three wickets. It's been a magnificent comeback by India, an extraordinary game of cricket. But undoubtedly the match winner has been Navjot Singh Sidhu. And his colleagues have come out on the field. Maninda Singh has just been out there to give him a good hug. One Singh to another. It's been a glorious innings by Sidhu. 134 not out he is there at the finish.